Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello, my name is Sita Petiwi. Today, I'm gonna tell you about my understanding about theme and rhythm. Theme identified as that or those elements that come first in class, and rhythm is the rest of the class. Now, I have an example about theme and rhythm. The class is I go to school. I identify as a theme and go to school identify as a brief. Why I becoming a theme? Because in this class, I is the subject or first element that uh, explain about the class. So that is called theme. And go to school is the brief because the rest of the class. In the theme and rhythm, we can find about the thematic progression. What is thematic progression? Thematic progression is the strategy that is used to linking between theme and rhythm in a class or a sentence. And to show the cohesion or the cohesive relation in the whole text. So, what is the cohesion itself? Cohesion is the situation of how the class can connect it and make relation in a whole text. In the thematic progression, uh, there are three types. First is constant theme or thematic creation, and second is zigzag or linear theme, and the third is the multiple theme or split rim pattern. First, I have the constant theme. As you can see, this is the scam of the constant theme. Theme 1 is repeated in the following theme. In here, I have three clubs. First is, Buddy is my friend. Buddy becoming theme 1 and is my friend becoming real 2. In the second class, I pick up Buddy and replace it in the second class, but I use he that refers to the booty. In the second class, he is kind. He becoming team two and is kind becoming real two. And booty repeated again in the third class and use he. He is smart too. He refers to booty. And he becoming theme 3 and is smart to becoming a real 3. Second is zigzag or linear theme. As you can see, this is the scam of the zigzag or linear theme. In here, the real 1 in the first clause becoming a theme in the second clause and is repeated in the following clause. In here, I have three clouds. The first is, my friends are Ami and Buddy. In here, my friends is a theme and Ami and Buddy is a rim. I pick up Ami and Buddy in the rim one to the second clause and place it into theme two and use they. They like ice cream. They is the theme two, and like ice cream is the rim two. I pick up again the ice cream as a rim in the rim two, and place it into the third clause, and place it as a theme three. The ice cream they like is vanilla. The ice cream becoming the theme three. And like is vanilla, it's a real trick. And the last but not least is the multiple theme or split rim pattern. This is the scam of the multiple rim. As you can see, in the real one is becoming the theme two, and also the theme in the 
hip trick. So this is called split grip pattern. In here I have three class again. First, my friends are Ani and Woody. My friends is the theme one and Ani and Woody is the grip one. I pick up Ani and Woody and place it in the, into the theme two. In here, use they. They are traveler. And then, I pick up Ani and Woody again in the third class and use they. They go to Bali together. They is the theme three and go to Bali together is the real three. In here, Ani and Woody repeat it twice in the second clause and the third clause. So the rim in the rim one repeated into theme in the second and the third clause. So this is the end of my explanations about theme and rim and thematic progression. I hope it can help you to understand about theme and rim and thematic progression. Thank you very much. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.